Welcome everybody, welcome. My name is Doth Joker Cutting with the DJC. Today we're getting back into the game Dreams. Uh more games created by you. Uh right now I am in a dream that is definitely uh a Spider Man styled game. Uh not that they could ever say that in dreams, so it is copyrighted and let's just say Sony and Disney don't like to share names. <laughs> but no, it's it's actually a pretty unique game. It's pretty fun um i'll just show you see so you can do a lot of stuff that you can do in you know the actual spider-man 2 game which makes it fun and interesting but i'm also going to say that it's very relaxing and i know that there's some people the do play the new Spider-Man game, for the relaxation of the swinging. Uh, the only problem is the world is pretty barren. There's no windows on the buildings. There's no people. There's no cars. So if you're really into just the relaxation of the swinging. This is definitely a game for you. Uh, there's also wall running. Let's see if I can get it to work right. There it is. It, it's actually pretty well done. I mean... Uh, the name of the game is called Swing. It's got pretty good physics. It's got, you know, what you would, what I would consider to be some pretty good Spider-Man physics, honestly. Um, it is a good game. It is pretty fun. I would, I would definitely, if you don't have an opportunity to play a Spider-Man game for money or whatever reason. This is a good alternative. I mean, at least for the swinging aspect. There's no fighting. There's no... Um, there's nothing along the lines of, of, of having to fight enemies or find bad guys. But you do have the opportunity to swing around the city and just enjoy it. Um, there is music. There's a couple different songs as well I'm not really trying to play them because I don't know if any of them are copyrighted but yeah that is the game called swing uh, it's created by Created energy and piece of craft. Uh, a very good game. It's very fun. I'm going to drop that a thumbs up. If you have an opportunity to play that in Dreams, go for it. I found another really sweet little, cool little tidbit game here. Um, let's see. It would be in my list, right? Of stuff I've played. Just got to find it. It was, it was, it was interesting. Oh, okay, so there's dreams I thumbed up. Um, Alright, so we're going to go to search. And I'll just look it up. Tiny. Toy. Racer? No, wasn't it? Uh, toy race? Maybe it was on a toy race. That was it. Right there. Tin Toy Rally is the game I played. It's it's interesting. It's fun. It's just it's just a vibe game. 
It's not a. Let me thumbs that up so I don't lose that. I'm gonna reset the progress too. See, that's what it shows you, okay? So you can toggle music, you can change the camera, you can restart from the last checkpoint, you can throttle and go in reverse, and you can display the controls at any time by pushing the big button. But yeah, this is it. Oh no. <laughs> well, let's let's try that again. Because it's actually, it's very well done, it's very unique. Uh, it's also a lot bigger than the than the picture shows you. I thought it was fun. It's got good physics. It's got and and I did it again. So we're gonna take a quick look around the outside here. See, I don't know if you are not supposed to drive around, but you can. It's like a teddy bear or a robot. Some random boxes. It's a fun little race game. You can drive around. We're going to go back to the map. I'm not going to hit the joystick this time, see? That's what it looks like taking a ramp. But yeah, it's it's a unique little fun game. Uh, it's The physics are pretty good. Looks like you steer from the front of the car. Um, you get this little cool part here, which which I thought was interesting. I thought this was the end of the race. It's not. And you get in the lift. And then once you're in the lift, you control the lift with your left thumbstick. Up, down. Up, down. Goes down to the bottom. Hmm. Now it's not letting me out. <laughs> Wouldn't let me go forward, but it let me go backwards. All right. But yeah, you can just follow the track around again. There's another little checkpoint right here. The helicopter doesn't take off or anything. Another little ramp. And then you're back at the beginning. It's a fun little game. Just something to, you know, pass some time and... Play with the interesting physics and you can explore the room. Which, uh, if you guys do decide to play this in Dreams, why don't you guys explore the room and tell me if you found something interesting? I'm gonna try and squeak out under the door here and see if there's a whole house to explore if it's just this room. Looks like it's just this room. But yeah, it's got a little bit you can explore. Some fun stuff to do. A little raceway. A little race game. Um, I enjoyed it. I thought it was cool. Especially because the first time we didn't wreck so much. But Oh, that, I'm sorry. That game was made by Matinee. Matinee. So, we're also going to go back in. Uh, there's Call of Duty Zombies and a bunch of other stuff. Um, steel Warriors is based off of real steel. Super Mario Brothers, Lu uh, Lumina, uh, Slide Out, it's just a Fly Game, Liminal Spaces, Zombie Hunter. This is this is for the spooky Halloween playlist. It's still up for a couple, for a little bit longer. But yeah, if you want to give it a shot, go ahead. Uh, I think next week we're gonna get back into some more spooky games. Um, let's try the maze. 
I just thought it'd be cool to see some of the stuff that's around here. Hi, Juvie. So I've never played this game. I don't know if you're a ball, if you're a person, if you're a top view, bottom view, if you're an idol. Hello? Leader. Hello? Actually, this looks like it might be a horror game. Ah. Uh, what is that? I thought it was going to be a chill maze exploration game. Apparently, it's not. When you're ready, press the square button to raise up the maze. Have a safe visit. People who enter the maze may experience nausea, disorientation, confusion, loss of consciousness, extreme fever, dehydration, mutation, implosion, and many other beneficial effects after the maze. There's a super secret trophy somewhere in the maze. Can I find it? Well, I don't know. Let's give it a shot. So yeah, we are a person running through the maze. We can jump. We can zoom in. We can get lost. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get back. Let's try and get back to the beginning. Yeah, see, we're back in the beginning, but I can't. Let's try this one. Yeah, I, I did do a double take to make sure I was heading <laughs> in a direction that I can work with. I didn't intend to play a full game today. I just intended to give you little snippets of little fun games that you, know, you could try on your own. But apparently I'm going to try and run this maze out. I'm going to try and get out of here. I don't think it's going to work. I don't think I have the necessary skills. And we've only made it from yellow to gray. So we don't have... We haven't gotten very far yet. And for all I know, where I think I'm going straight, I could be going not straight. Yep, look at that. any of you guys decide to play this let me know if you make it out of here uh, if you're wondering why I'm looking up it is because the best way through a maze is to see where the walls are Sometimes the top corner of the wall. Um. Hello. Hello. All right. Interesting. Uh, best way to see which way to go in the maze is through looking at the top tiles, uh, tops of the walls. 
because you can see shadows a little better than it would be staring like this. Uh, you might not know that you can turn down that way because the shadow looks the same. But if you look here, and this wall on this side right here is moving more than this one, then that means there's a gap. You can fit through there. At least that just works for me that way. Uh, might not work for anyone else that way. But we found the giant triangle of flowers. Footsteps sound good, and there's no rush to, to complete the maze. You're not being chased by anything. At least I don't think. I, I might not be far enough in the maze to know. But yeah, this is one of my three suggestions of the day. Give the maze a shot, and let me know if you beat it. that um well man I wasn't supposed to play a horror game today I was just supposed to chill crap Maybe there is some deals here. I'm, I'm not feeling real comfortable now. No map either, so wait, what? Grab physical objects, equip, unequip. There's a lot going into this, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, is um, we're actually going to we're gonna stop this right here for today. The sun is moving too, so that's gonna add layers of complication to this, but yeah. I think we're going to save this right here. Wolves. And we are going to give this a much deeper thorough run through. Next week. I'll see you guys next Tuesday. Back in the maze. Here on Dreams. Bye bye.